If the height of the disc was 70% of its normal height or more, the prone press-up helped vacuum in the disc bulge. If the disc had lost more height than 70%, it was squashed down a bit, the McKenzie prone press-up tended to not vacuum in the disc bulge. So there was the first level of precision uh, that we uh, discovered. Then in another study, uh, I took some spines and we did the same thing. We created partial disc herniations and then we didn't do prone press-ups. We simply adopted a McKenzie isometric position, not movement, just extend and lay. Do you know, Mariana, we got exactly the same vacuuming effect of the disc if the disc had 70% of its joint height remaining or more. So if it didn't work in squash down discs.